Let's promise to be completely honest with one another. We tell each other our most personal fears. My biggest fear is drowning. My biggest fear is losing you. flick Fear, which will be available for streaming on Tuesday the 25th. And joining us now is the movie's director, producer, and writer, Dion Taylor, and Chicago's very own actor, Joseph Sakura. Gentlemen, thank you for thank coming, you for coming in. in. Great to be here. Thank yeah. you. All right, so it was in movies, yep. in the theaters. Mm -hmm. How did it do? It, it did great. great, especially yeah. in Chicago, which we had such a great turnout. We did the AMC at McClure Court. We had a great turnout there, and we had a couple of really fantastic weeks the theater experience is second to none for a movie like this however, however now you get a chance on the 25th to download to stream to own in fact i think they can stream it now no you can stream it now yeah, yeah you can actually buy it now but on the 25th it's available everywhere okay oh. yeah and it has that look that that the, the way you shot it it's, it's got that dark look that already puts you in a heightened mood couple it with when it was shot and kind yeah. of what it's about it Chilly out there. <laughs> it's a good movie, man. It's fun. You know, we made this film uh, during the height of the pandemic. Mm -hmm. It was the first movie to actually be shot during that time. Um, and it was just independent spirit, man. Like, we all kind of came together and descended on this one place and had a great idea. And we did it. And um, I called Joe, and he was in Brooklyn at the time. I was like, man, you got to come down here to Tahoe. It's like, I'm Please. scared to leave the house. Because <laughs> like, we were in the pandemic. Yeah. Yeah. It's easy to, Dion always says this, it's easy now that we have the information on COVID. We, at least we have an understanding. The unknown, which is what we were living in. We didn't know how long COVID lived on glass right. or on your clothes right. or yeah. whatever. So there was like this intrinsic fear while we were filming it that truly is kind of documenting that time in our history as a society on film. Yeah. We have that. So when but between takes, we were like, were we breathing too long, Dion? Was, yeah. that, was that a six-minute take no, really without masks? Masks on, real, man. you know, because yeah. one co positive COVID case would have shut us down. Oh, yeah. Movie, yeah. So it was layer upon layer of fear yeah. involved Absolutely. in this movie. Yeah, and when you watch the film, you actually can see the performances where the actors are in these moments where when we say cut, they are really saying, man, we, are we okay? Yeah. Uh, which made the movie even cooler to me later. Now we watch, we're like, damn, that's crazy. He was looking at the movie. I mean, it was, it was, I was like, what's the worst could happen? You could die, dude. It's all right. No, but it was, it was, it was great. But what we were trying to do was just be, um, be artists, man, express ourselves. Um, I've always made a point of trying to be the filmmaker that makes good commercial movies, but they also have to have a meaning. I wanted to make a movie that just embodied fear and what it meant. And the reality of it is when you manifest fear, it will kill you. You know what I mean? So that's what the film is about. Like, how do you actually overcome your biggest fears or the small fears that become big. Yeah, because you tackle a lot of them. Yeah. Uh, claustrophobia, yeah. drowning, yeah. Yeah. Or even losing like, loved ones. And even bigger ideas of fear of commitment. Yeah. Um, and fear of non-commitment, of like being in this or getting rid of that. Like, I think we all find ourselves in situations or relationships that we're scared to leave yeah. because yeah. what's the outcome going to be? Change. I, yeah, yeah, absolutely change. Well, I, Dean, I got to say, you do a lot of very scary, dark stuff. That uh, seems to be your genre. Where do you come up with the ideas? Because they get, <laughs> I mean, the intruder, uh, all of it, it's something that could really happen to people, and that's what makes it all really scary. Yeah. I, just, I think I love, um, I love what movies are supposed to represent, which is escapism. Uh, I grew up in a time out here where, you know, we would sneak our food in the theater, sneak your candy in, yeah. you know what I mean? And you sit there and you watch something that actually transported you somewhere else. And I think films should do that. So most most films that worked for me early on were, were thrillers, horrors, you know, fun comedies. When you see this film, you go through the same experience, but now when you leave, you actually leave with something positive. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think this movie resonates that way in a real way. Because you're right. going to have to face your fear at some point. Yeah, at some point, yeah. one way or another, it's going to yeah. come get you. Yeah, that's come right. Get you. Real quickly, yeah. power. 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 Ooh, yes, you're working talk on... Talk about it. You're working talk on about season it. Season three? We're, we're, well, um... 
No, I think I can say fairly we're not working on season oh. three. No, um, I don't, you know, hey, listen, this is all above my pay grade. Uh, but I can tell Actually, you. Actually, it's not. What I, <laughs> what I can tell you is that Dion did the finale of season yes. one, as we all know, which was a fantastic episode. And he did the finale of season two, which okay. is a phenomenal season. Yes. If you liked season one of the Tommy spinoff of The mm, Power yeah. Show, you are going to love season two. And I swear to God, we got Chicago right this yeah. time. So okay. I think Chicago's going to respond. And I think just like the original Power series, New York responded, gave its a seal of approval. We hit the big time. I think with uh, Power Book Four, that uh, people are Chicago's going to say they got it right this time. No, they and got it right this time. It's incredible. I was there. Yeah, yes. it was. Like, I know. That's season right. Two, I know. Season two of Power. Gary no. Lennon, our showrunner, is Man, fantastic. Wait till y'all see this. Yeah, okay. No, it's, it's 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 phenomenal. And and we captured Chicago the right way, the people the right way, um, the different shades of people in the city the right way. Shout out to Isaac Keys and Chris Lofton and the entire team over there. Man, they. You're gonna love it. Awesome. All right. He's Can't canceling wait. Christmas. He's, I'm gonna he, cancel. He's, he's gonna cancel Halloween. Every, every, yeah, that's how good it is. <laughs> yeah. okay. yeah. Most holidays it. are canceled next week. <laughs> All right. Gentlemen, thank, thank you, you so thank much. You. Congratulations. Man, it's fear, man. Yes. It's available right. now fear. in 25th. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. They were great. So fun talking yeah, to them. So nice yeah. talking. I, and watching the trailer for fear because I haven't seen it because I can't watch scary movies. Yeah, I can me neither. Barely get through the trailer. I know. It's like, yeah.